You teeter on the edge of an abyss. Your survival depends on the choices you make. They will be as a compass guiding you through the unknown. Will you find the path to salvation or be lost in the darkness forever? Let me speak plainly. You're about to make some difficult decisions. Decisions that will affect the lives of others. How those decisions play out will become clear over time. It's good to see you again. You're probably keen to get started. Let us not dally any longer. As you are aware, I am the curator, the custodian of tales. My purpose is to keep a record of everything you do, every decision or mistake you make. This is my repository. Filled with untold stories. Stories about friends and enemies. Loyalty and betrayal. Life. And death. Understand that I am not here to help you. Although, I have been known to bend the rules from time to time. To descend into the unknown alone is extremely brave. Or extremely foolish. Perhaps there is more to you than meets the eye. Let me give you a few words of advice. Throughout the story, you will encounter certain pictures. Pictures which allude to possible outcomes. I suggest you pay attention to their meaning. It could foreshadow a future best avoided. But alas, the sands of time have run out for us. We'll meet again soon to see how you fare. Or fail. Particularly. Welcome to Camp Slayer. You're early. At the moment, that's it. Apologies for arriving early. It's my meeting room prepped. When the periyala tarik na, impatient ay gulto. Is my briefing room prepped? Texts are ready for your presentation. As soon as we get word from the CEO, you're good to go. You should read this. Then you hear? There's a new king in the castle. Looks that way. You are? Hmm. I just stand careful with that case. Case solo. Careful with that case. Careful, Clarice. That's valuable research. Yes, sirree. Dr. Stokes, at your service. First Lieutenant Jason Kolchak. Wow. The briefing room? I'm on the character the opposite of a bubble at Chicago. Is this much of a dick? Huh? So many dick levels. This is like a two. Wait till he turns it up to eleven. Can't you keep up? This could be our last time together, Rachel. 
after what happened at the checkpoint, I, I thought I was done. These last few weeks, you've, you've lifted me up. I don't know where I'd be without you. Rachel King? Colonel King has arrived on base, ma'am. He's en route to the briefing room. I'll be there in five. Fuck, it's him. He's early. Your husband, you mean? Don't you think it's about time you came clean? Put your clothes back on. Straighten up. I mean, Rachel, are you gonna tell him about us or what? You and Eric have been apart for a year. Whatever you had, it, it's gotta be over. Come on. நல்ல தொடர்பு வேறையாடா ஒரு வருஷம் பிரிஞ்சாலும் சரி அதுக்கு என்ன சரி அது நம்ம பிரச்சனை தற்காலிகமா தள்ளி போடுவோம் just have to keep a little distance it sounds like an order ma'am say no more i get it shit to excuse the noise and disorder we're just getting the base set up hmm blows my mind only a few weeks ago Saddam was living it up in here <laughs> chowing down in candy bars while some poor bastard clipped his toenail nice image uh, if only you could see the state of this place now it makes me smile <laughs> got the CIA We got the army, the marines, DIA, the air force. Hey, everyone's invited. Everyone wants a piece of history. God bless America. Ego para departments ala vande arangecha. So edo history thondi eduka poranga. I see you old man. Keep busting out those reps. Hey, you come join me. Maybe I'll teach you a thing or two. Later. We have company. Yeah. This here would like to watch me get my sweat on. Huh? You gonna spot me, little lady? I see you just fine from here, thanks. Ignore Corporal Merwin. He likes social skills. Uh, I guess every unit has its resident jackass. Sergeant K. This is Lieutenant Colonel Kane. Just taking him down to the briefing room. Yeah, gotta go get prep. I'll see you in there, Marine. So what's his malfunction? Nick ain't been himself lately. We got caught up in a shooting a few weeks back. His villain ate a bullet. Nick took it hard. Is he combat ready? He's a big boy, sir. He's ready. Damn, Joey, they got you sitting behind a desk? You want me to make a call? Nah, I'm all good. People who sit behind desks don't tend to catch so many bullets, you know? So this must be uh, the one and only satellite guy. You know what I'm saying? I am your commander. Go to the one. Lieutenant Colonel Eric King. And if I'm not mistaken, Lance Corporal, that makes me your commanding officer. <laughs> shit me, right? Crap, he's not shit me. Give the colonel full side access. Sir. If that were you, I wouldn't get too comfortable behind that desk. I'm telling you, when the queen bitch finds out about this, she's gonna flip her shit. 
we know each other that's my wife wife and soli roman mm la husband's rapo we know each other rachel and i we know each other she'll understand all's fair in love and war sir the queen bitch you're referring to is his wife <laughs> nice work got shot Sure. I'm so sorry. Rachel never said she was married. We've been working apart this last year. So she's the queen bitch now. She's gone up in the world. If it helps, we like to think of it as a term of endearment. Shut up. I hope the bandwidth can cope with the data. After that, I'll leave the techie stuff. 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 I'll leave Long as you don't step on my foot. So, where a country military or anything? Colonel King. Mrs. King. Eric, this is my team. And if you want to brief them, you clear it with me first. Hmm. I should have called this is my team now. Arrogant aware. This is my team now. What are you talking about? I have direct orders from CENTCOM to assume command of your task force. Oh. Shh. Are you serious? Have you known me to be any other way? Lieutenant Kolchak, if you'd be so kind. This is from Sox Central. It confirms that Lieutenant Colonel King has assumed control of this operation. I'm going to need access to your network. Who the hell are you? This is Dr. Stokes. I've given her full clearance. I bet you have. Okay. I guess I'll go figure it out for myself. Dr. Stokes, please prepare the presentation. You found something? What the fuck is that? Modern art or something? This is footage from the highly classified Kalis program. That's supposed to mean something to me. It's a thermal satellite system that I personally pioneered. Oh, well, I'm impressed. Please, pioneer away. You behave like this in all your briefings, Corporal? Boys are just eager to catch a break, sir. No harm meant. Very well. Satellite sweeps of the war zone have uncovered what appears to be an underground storage facility. This will, of course, require further investigation, but I strongly suspect where Saddam's chemical weapons are hidden. We got you, you son of a bitch. CENTCOM has given the green light to raid the facility and seize any weapons on site. Hostilities may be over, but there are holdout groups of Republican Guard all over the country. They could deploy those weapons at any time, so we need to move fast. The Army is giving us a ride out there in their helos. On arrival, Lieutenant Kolchak will lead the raid on the facility. Once it's secured, we'll carry out a full weapons inspection. Now listen up. There's been a change of leadership, but Rachel's operational expertise and local knowledge is just as valuable as ever. She'll be flying with us, and I want you all to show her the same respect. Any questions? 
Well, the fuck we waiting for? I'm ready. That's tribal territory out there, Colonel. Make no mistake. Those people are feral. I take it we're getting their support? Nah. Too many birds could bring them down on us. We move fast in, fast out. Yeah, that's pretty much what your mama said to me. Hey, careful, boy. If I didn't pull out so fast, it could have been your papi. <laughs> All right, that's enough, Merwin. Sir, what's your call? Okay, let's go right for now. Either chemical or pencil, I want to venture for now. So that time you under come now. We keep this small. I'll request air support. Tanya, we come. We keep this thing small. If it goes south, I'll pull the plug and we can bug out. With all due respect, I think that's the wrong call. With all due respect, Lieutenant Kolchak, it's not your decision to make. This feel right to you? Merwin has a point. If we spin up too many helos, we'll increase our chance of being spotted. Any concerns? See me after the briefing. We go dark until weapons are secured. If we don't break radio sounds within 24 hours, CENTCOM will mount a rescue operation. A lot of shit can go down in 24 hours. I'll quit being a bitch. I'm just saying, that's all. This is why we went to war. This is what gets us out of bed every morning. Make no mistake, ladies and gentlemen, this is how we stop Saddam from using these weapons. Be ready in one hour. Dismissed. Clarice, help me set up the equipment. I'm on it. I don't know, man. This don't feel right. I'm getting this tingle down the back of my neck. Oh, sweetie. Look, good rub down will sort that right out, huh? I'm serious. I've got a real bad feeling about this. That's what you get from spending too much time with Eric. Is there anything you can do? I'm going to download the latest satellite data. You can have some alone time with him. Thank you, Clarice. I have concerns. Well? This team barely know each other. And you're thinking about sending them 500 clicks into bandit country. It's too soon. They're not even remotely close to being ready. If I'm not mistaken, they're forced recon. It's their job to be ready. We don't have time to rework this. This is what's going to get us home, Rachel. I wish you'd reconsider. No, my decision is final. You should know. It wasn't my decision to take over your operation. See, dear, can you? You and the two people, Panjai, they are up now. This is our big break. I have missed you. Missed you, what to do? It's been a long time since we last saw each other. Eric, please let me finish. Not a day went by when you weren't on my mind. when i didn't want you by my side i've missed you so much rage this isn't about us eric i just want things to go back to the way they were how we left it things weren't so great between us we've been through worse a lot worse look eric we'll talk when we have time but not here Not like this. You're still wearing your wedding ring. <clears throat> hey, be careful with that. Oh shit! Sorry. What you got in that box of tricks anyway. What the fuck is that? Ultraviolet light. We use it to sweep for explosives. Let me have a go. No. How much longer for that download, Clarice? I need it ASAP. It's five minutes ASAP enough for you. Downloading data now. Good. I'll check the satellite maps. Not the greatest bandwidth. We work with what we have. Can you sign this 1348? Huh? Equipment release form. Can you? Oh sure. Check all equipment, then check it again. 
Yeah, I hear you. இது ரெண்டாயிரத்தி மூணுல நடக்கிறதுனால சதாம் சதாம் ஹுசைனை ரெஃபர் பண்றாங்களான்னு தெரியல இருக்கலாம் நம்ம சதாமனை வச்சுக்கோ ஸோ கீழே கெமிக்கல் வெப்பன்ஸ் எல்லாம் இருக்கு அதை நம்ம உள்ள வந்து அடிச்சு எல்லாத்தையும் எடுக்க போறோம் ஸோ இப்போதைக்கு மேப்போ சம்திங் அந்த ஏரியாவோட டீட்டெயில்ஸ் எல்லாம் டவுன்லோட் ஆகிட்டு இருக்கு அப்படின்ட்டு அது வரைக்கும் நம்ம இவங்ககிட்ட பேசிட்டு இருக்கணும் I think we'll bag chemical Ali at this facility. He's in the vicinity, we'll get him. <laughs> that almost makes it worth the risk. Almost. Well, you know, I'd still rather be sitting behind a desk. Sir, I've heard some fucked up stories about the border. You sure you don't want air support? There's a chance we'll need him. We have the element of surprise on our side. I will not allow anything to jeopardize that. Please, Colonel. Can we take a step back and think about this for a minute? I've made my decision. You feeling lucky, Lance Corporal? Well, my parents owned a horse named Lucky. He ran away. Bet the farm on this. I have a good feeling we're going to clear up. I wish I shared your optimism, Colonel. I'm going to tell you that I'm going to tell you that I'm going to tell you. இன்ஸ்பெக்ட் இது பண்ணியாச்சு இதில் என்ன இருக்கு எக்ஸாம் ஆயிடாது ஒயிட் பாஸ்பரஸ் ஒயிட் பாஸ்பரஸா ஓகே ஜஸ் ஓகே தீஸ் ஆர் அண்ணாத்திரது வேணா எடுத்துக்கோ ஹேர் சப்போர்ட் வேணான்ட்டும் உதவு கெமிக்கல் வெப்பன்ல வந்து யூஸ் பண்ணக்கூடாது கான்பிடென்ஷியல் What the hell do we need this crap for? We need to be mobile. We need to be prepared. The facility is underground, possibly under construction. It's safer this way. You want me to feel safe? You give me some more shooters. Relax, proactive, you are afraid of ice, so you are my technician. Mm. Tell me, Corporal, are you afraid of heights? <laughs> Please, I'm forced recon. I'm trained in high altitude, low opening parachute jumps. Hostile conditions that would make most men wake up screaming for their mama. You paint quite the picture. I hope you're more than just mouth, Marine. climbing gear fucking pencil pusher okay chinna bombu lagra mari pesiyachu idu na survey group objectives na thevalla hey inna mari download avala இதை என்ன இன்ஸ்பெக்ட் பண்ணுவோம் வேற வேண்டா இருக்கீங்க பேசுறது இங்க ஒரு கான்பிடென்ஸ்ல தானே Project Bandit Activities for Industry and Workers. Wow. 
Download H. Downloads complete. Let's get to the helos. What? What? You want to ask me something? I can tell by that look on your face. What do you think of him? I take it you're talking about the skipper? He's a hard ass and he wants us to know it. But I ain't bothered by that. I like it, actually. The guy's a corn cob off his ass. But we're heading, believe me. We're gonna need someone tough in control. <laughs> 